folks, I'm Gary Dunshee here at Big Ben Saddlery, and uh, this month we're going to deviate a little bit from our usual tack tip. This isn't involved in tack, but it's something we've gotten a lot of inquiries about, and that's the cowhide rugs, the hair on cowhide rugs. And uh, they're ornamental, you can use them as rugs on the floor, throw them over a couch, whatever. But what people are mostly interested in are the care of them. Well, the care starts whenever you purchase one. You want to be sure that you're buying a good one to start with because there's real good ones and there's real bad ones and there's everything in between. And the first thing you want to do, most of the good ones are real short haired. And that's because they harvest them in the summer. They're called summer kills whenever the animal's hair is short. And you'll have less problems with these than the old long haired ones. The long haired ones can can have all sorts of problems. But these short hair ones, they, they, they tend to do a lot better. As far as cleaning them, you can vacuum them with your vacuum cleaner. You can take them outside and shake them. Um, you can hose them down, but I wouldn't make that a regular practice. Maybe if something got spilled on it or something, you could do that because they are leather on the back side and water and leather don't get along too good on a on a regular basis uh, these are chrome tans so you don't want to put any oil on the leather or anything like that um, but if you do need to hose it down take it outside throw it over the fence and hose it down real good and get it clean and then you may after give it a little bit and then throw it over the other way where the leather is showing and the hairs to the inside and give that leather a chance to dry. It's going to take a lot longer for the leather to dry than it is for the hair side to dry. Um, some of the other things you can do with them, like if you make a rug out of them and you throw them on a tile floor or a concrete floor, wood floor, something like that, um, they're so big they don't scoot around or anything like that. They're not slippery, but um, in some instances, the edges can kind of curl up, and you can take two-sided carpet tape and put in the areas where you think it might curl up and just kind of spot treat it to, to hold them down. That keeps them down real nice where they're not trying to curl up all the time. If you do happen to get a spot that curls up and won't stay back down or the edges go to looking raggedy, you can just take a razor blade and trim the edges off. You might want to take it outside to do it because you're going to be cutting the hair as well. And that cut hair is going to fall on the floor if you do it inside. But you might just take it outside on the porch or in the yard or something and just trim it with a razor blade, shake it out real good and take it back inside and look like a new rug. Thanks for watching. If we can help you with any other kind of tack tip or anything about leather, just give us a call.